Good morning, Radiator Springs. And good morning, America. My name's Tony Allen, and he is... Lightning McQueen. And we got a serious topic today. You can guess it, and he can guess it. It's about the federal government and how it can improve our lives today. You said it, Tony. Do you know anything about the federal government? Well, of course I do, Tony. Then explain. The federal government makes laws to help better our lives by providing care, support, and gives us an opportunity to be safe and protected. Wow, that was great. Back to you, Sierra. Thank you guys for that wonderful update. Now, do you wanna know how the federal government helps people with low, no job or low financial income? Let me explain. Food stamps. If you are found eligible, you will receive money and benefits on an electronic benefit transfer card, which works like a debit card. Benefits are automatically loaded into your account each month, where you can use that EBT card to buy groceries at authorized food stores and retailers. Stimulus checks. For example, due to the pandemic, federal lawmakers enacted a $2 trillion economic stimulus package on March 27, 2020, that sent most Americans checks of up to $1,200 as a way to put money directly into the pockets of families struggling to manage ec the economic fallout due to the uh, pandemic. Unemployment checks. Unemployment insurance allows you to temporarily receive a portion of your wages as cash benefits while you search for a new job. Typically, you must meet a certain prior work and wage requirements and must be unemployed through no fault of your own. Thank you. Back on to you, Tony. Thank you, Sierra. Reporting live from Radiator Springs, it's Lightning McQueen, along with... Bob Stoutmeyer. And Mr. Bob Stoutmeyer. Uh, since we're on the topic of federal government... Okay. Do you think... Uh, do you think that the federal government has a right to enforce taxes on us? And do you think, uh, how does it affect you in your everyday life? I feel like the federal government has the right to enforce these taxes because it affects me in my everyday life because I have to go get stuff. I have to go visit my mother. I have to go get my car wash. And I got to get food. I, I'm hungry. You feel me? But I don't like paying them because it diminishes my bank account. However, they are very beneficial. Thank you, Mr. Stoutmeyer. And since we're on the topic of, of taxes... Uh, could you give us a little rundown on taxes and how they affect our communities and our schools and help build our schools? Why not? Give me this mic. The federal government collects revenue from a variety of sources, including individual income taxes, payroll taxes, cooperate income taxes, and excise taxes. It also collects revenue from services like admission to Still national parks and cu custom duties. The federal taxes you pay are used by the government to invest in technology and education and to provide goods and services for the benefit of the American people. The three biggest categories now, listen up, the three biggest categories are of expenditures are major health programs such as Medicare and Medicaid. Thank you, Mr. Seltmeyer. Back to you, Tony. Thank you guys, back from the studio. Hello, my name is Sierra Mist, live from Route 66, and I'm here to talk about how the federal government can protect and provide citizens through military and healthcare. So, the United States Department of Veteran Affairs is an agency of the federal government that provides healthcare, benefits, and cemetery services to the military veteran, veterans. The Secretary of Veterans Affairs, who is a cabinet level official, is appointed by the president with the advice and consent of the Senate. Back to you, Tony and Lightning. Oh my. And thank you, Mr. Miss. What a wonderful update. And Tony, do you know how the government can provide health benefits for you and your family? I know you got little Tony out there shooting some hoops as I did back in the day. Well, as a matter of fact, yes, I do. Now let me explain. Medicare and Medicaid save lives, help people live longer, and provide the peace of mind that comes with the affordable health care that's there when you need it. Of course, Tony. 